Uh, it's been a pleasure visiting the Healthcare Summit because I think we are touching at a very important point about how to bring machine learning, medicine, AI across the continuum of care, right from the preventive health to the treating health. And, and I'm a clinician and I'm absolutely excited about being here. Very soon, we are going to be sitting in driverless cars, and that's very much a reality. Very soon, probably the hospitals might be doctorless now. It won't go really doctorless, but what is going to happen is all the technology that we are going to have is going to enable taking better decisions. There's going to be all the technology helping us to predict what could be the future of health. Maybe one day we can live 100 years or no, that could be predicted by the AI, the technologies which is helping us right now. So I think the important takeaway from all of this is that we all have to talk to each other. The data which we are gathering from imaging to pathology to radiology and then put it up for pharmacy or therapeutic angle and also from the diagnostic end. So I think this is an amazing time to be a clinician as well where we can impact lives. The future of healthcare is going to be definitely shaped by Industry 4.0. It's, I mean, 15 years back when I became a clinician and particularly a neurologist, people told me because you just like talking, you know, you're never going to do anything real. And I think we are going to start to do something real by making this technology. So you're going to wear all the wearables. We're going to have all the diagnostic equipments back home. The doctor is going to get the real time data things before it pops out and gets out of control. We are going to nip that in the bud by having all the preventive measures. So this is going to be the future of healthcare. And I believe it has already started to happen, but what is required, and, and that is a big takeaway from the conference as well, is that all the insurance, the data providers, the pro healthcare providers, the clinicians, and the community, everybody will have to work together to make this happen.